this window thing. Oh, uh, yeah. And the little my... shelf here. <laughs> no? Where? Okay, don't tell me where then. Where do I go? <laughs> Today we're playing hide and seek in Minecraft in my bedroom. I'm not even kidding. We asked some professional Minecraft builders to completely build my real life bedroom in Minecraft. And now we're gonna play hide and seek in it. If you wanna see more hide and seek, make sure you press on the like button at 50,000 likes. We'll do some more. Breaking news! Guys, I'm sorry to interrupt this video, but the jelly glow in the dark controllers are coming out July 31st at 1 p.m. Eastern. Make sure you write it down because this is gonna be epic. Now let's continue with the video. Jelly felt bad for me today. As you can hear, my voice is not too well. I am a little bit sick. So like the good friend he was, he invited me to his home in Minecraft. Look at this. And basically, we gotta hide from each other. The seeker is a giant or normal sized and the hiders are really tiny. If you want more hide and seek, make sure to hit that like button. And also, if you want some merchandise like this, Team Floppy, go to Cranestall.com. Now let's get right into the video. I'm not on the ground. I think I've been caught. Today, we're gonna be playing hide and seek in Jelly's bedroom. One key difference though, the hiders are tiny. Well, actually that's not true. Technically, the seeker is huge in a huge bedroom. You'll see what we mean. Now, if you wanna see this in my bedroom, click the like button. And also head over to slogo.com to get some beautiful merch. Anyway, let's get into the video. 